Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Amy and I'm going to be doing my May monthly reset. So I've got four books in total that I'm going to be talking about in this video. I, um, I'm going to go and do my journal in a minute. I'm currently recording on my phone because my um, memory card seems to not go on my computer. So instead of holding, I have got the books here, but they're going to be back to front when I record. So instead of hold them up I'm just going to put pictures up here so you can see what I've got I mean I do have them here but like I said it's going to be back to front for you obviously inside here's one of them but I just um edited and uploaded my April blog which in that you will see my kids choosing what I read I haven't put a video in like a clip in there of Carl choosing because where he works away sometimes it's I don't get hold of him and I quickly had to do it the other day because I was like, oh, babe, I need you to, I need you to pick out one for me. So I'm going to quickly go do my journal and then I'm going to come back and then I'm going to talk about the books I'm going to be reading. So I'll see you in a little while.
<laughs> right hi guys i'm back so i've done my journal and i've um got video of all that and then b-roll of all doing that with um me doing it so the four books that i am going to be reading i'll put them up here so the first one is going to be things we left behind by lucy score this is the third book in the series i'm quite excited to read it i have been putting it off for ages it's um, about the, the third couple. So obviously there's three couples. You have the first couple in the first book, then you have the second couple, and then you have this couple. But you see this couple in the other books and they hate each other. And I'm hoping in this book we find out why they hate each other. And there is a history there. You can tell just by the tension in like the other books. So I'm really excited to um, get to this one. And then the next book that I'm going to be reading, which I've also been putting off for ages. I had it on my Vampathon TBR actually. But I haven't had it out, like, come out of the jar again since. And I haven't put it on any TBR since. And that is The Very Secret Society of Regular Witches. Basically, it's about a witch that gets hired to go to this house to teach three young witches how to be witches. And I don't know if there's a romance in there. I think there might be a romance in there. But that's all I really know about it. I do like to mainly go into my books quite blind. So then I don't know what's going on. Do I then sometimes look up spoilers to see if they actually get together? Yes. Yes, I do. But why not? Who doesn't do that? I did that in Throne of Glass. I did it to see if um, Selena got with Dorian. And I can I just completely spoiled the whole series for myself, basically, because I found out who she got with. So I don't really mind. I've done it with all the Zodiac Academy books. I've done it. I've done it with most books, to be fair. I've done it with Blood and Ash. I've done it. I've done it with. I like to know who they're going to be with. I did it with I think the only one I didn't do it with was Akatar because I went into that blindly and I don't think I actually did it with Crescent City but Throne of Glass because I was talking about it and I was talking about it with my friends like oh my god I love Dorian I love Dorian I love Dorian she's like hmm and I was like oh do they not get together do they I mean I don't know I'm not going to tell you if they do or not because that would be a spoiler but saying that though I do love that series, it's my favourite. Anyway, I'm rambling on. So yes, yeah, so my next book is going to be The Very Secret Society of Witches, which I'll put up there. And then the next book that um, I'll be reading, which has been on mm, maybe two of this year's TBRs, I'm not 100% sure. I do love this author though. To be honest, I have just started it while I was doing my journal because it is the 1st of May today, so... I'm trying to get this done so I can get it all up and uploaded in the next couple of days so it's done. But I have started listening to this. I think I'm on that chapter three, chapter four now. And that is Fall of Ruin and Wrath by Jennifer Armitrout. Um, it's basically about this girl who um, is lowborn and you have these highborns. And she has the gift of sight and she can basically like feel what other people are feeling. But obviously she... I don't really know anything else other than that, to be honest, because like I said, I like to go in blind. I do have, I am going to show you these sprayed edges though, because they are stunning. Because um, obviously I got the Waterstones edition. It doesn't have anything under the dust jacket, so I just thought I'd just share those edges with you because they are beautiful. And then the last book that I'm going to be reading is the one that Carl chose. Um, apparently this is basically um, Gideon the Night meets game of thrones but to be honest when i look at this cover cover it basically looks like a badass version of selena sardothian from throne of glass and i'm here for it i am going to show you the edges as well and then you can see if you can try and guess what book it is which is this one look at the detail on there and that is bonesmith which i'll put up there i don't really know anything about this either all i know is that she's a ghost killer or a ghost hunter and she has to go save a prince and that is all i know about it i am really excited to hopefully get to all these books in may like i said i have already started i really also do want to read the ashes and this star curse king i have it over there i think i even put it in the vlog for april because i was going to start reading it but then i never did I have my tabs set up, I have my annotations all set up, ready to go, I just need to actually read it. But if I can have a Kindle book and an audio book, I normally then have a physical book on the go, but I like to try and read those. I might start that tonight, so I might add it onto this TBR, so I'm going to put it up here, so I might add that onto this TBR, because Carl's not at home tonight, and I don't 
want to listen to it so I because obviously I'm going to be annotating it so I want to physically read it and then obviously I'm going to be cooking dinner so I'll be listening to a fall of um wrath and ruin and wrath I keep saying wrath and ruin because yeah anyway but I'm going to have to quickly cut this short and I'm going to end the video here I really hope you enjoy this video and you like my spreads I really hope you subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video and I'll hopefully see you in a few vlogs in May bye bye for now